Okay, this is the Moffat Field Museum right here, and what we have uh, is uh, in front of you right here is the uh, U.S. U.S. Uh, Macon here, and uh, it is the sister ship of the Akron. Uh, they're I, almost identical in in every fashion, and what you uh, what you're looking at there is uh, in in fact uh, the the eyes of the U.S. fleet. In the early 1930s is when they uh, they made the two. Uh, uh, the two airships right there, uh, the Goodyear Tire Corporation got the contract and they worked uh, with the Zeppelin Corporation uh, in order to go ahead and make the two airships because the Germans were by and far the leaders in this. So in the early 1930s they made both the, uh, the Akron and the Macon and uh, uh, the whole purpose of the airship themselves were to be the eyes of the U.S. fleet. If you look down at the lower portion right here you can see a little teeny airplane and right over in this section would be the uh, where they kept the hangar, as a matter of fact. And inside the hangar, they kept four of these little uh, scout airplanes, and they were to be the ones that are looking for the bad guys. Uh, they would go out and look for the bad battleships and tell the good battleships where they were. Uh, these are the days before the British invented radar, so this was uh, uh, very, very important that uh, these little guys uh, were able to do their job, and that's why Admiral Moffat indeed pushed for this program to make both the Akron and the Macon.